The first time since he was shot in the Dominican Republic, David Ortiz is talking about the incident with an English language newspaper. Ortiz spoke with the Boston Globe about the shooting, discussing both the incident itself and his recovery since. WBZ's Jim Smith is live outside Fenway Park for us tonight. He has that and also some reaction from Red Sox Nation. Jim? And Ken, the fans I spoke with tonight figure it's a good sign that David Ortiz is feeling well enough to do an interview with the Boston Globe, and he certainly had a lot to say. David Ortiz looked a lot like his old self last Monday night, throwing out the first pitch at Fenway. I want to thank all of you for all the prayers. But in an exclusive interview with the Boston Globe, Big Poppy reveals just how close to death he came after being shot in the Dominican Republic just over three months ago. Describing the shooting itself, Ortiz says, I felt a burning sensation. I felt weird, like not myself, as I went down. He told the Globe he began to lose hope during his long recovery and at times felt like he was going to die. People need to understand, this isn't a movie where you get shot in the street and you're back two minutes later. No, I got shot and almost died. I only have one life to live. I can't just go to the pharmacy and buy another one. As for baseball fans, they're glad he's still around after such a close call. That's that's just great, you know, that he's recovering. So it's great for, for baseball, it's great for the city of Boston, but more important, great for him and his family. He's been through some stuff, and to, to see that he's all healed and, and getting there, glad to see it. I think that's fantastic, you know, but especially the city of Boston. I mean, he really is a hero to them. What happened was senseless, and I'm glad that he's on the way to recovery. Ortiz says he expects to be fully recovered by Thanksgiving and also tells the Globe he's looking for answers, saying... I want to find out who did this. I'm not going to sit around and chill if there's somebody out there who wants to kill me. And tonight, Ortiz is also expressing thanks to Red Sox Nation. He also told the Globe that he's been touched by how generous and kind everybody has been to him and his family. Live outside Fenway, Jim Smith, WBZ News. All right, Jim, thanks.